Write an email to tim at apple.com with subject looking forward to WWDC 2025. Um, in the email, say that, you, that I'm li really looking forward to WWDC, uh, especially the new iOS 19, iPadOS 19 and watchOS 12 updates. Also to the new updates to Apple Vision Pro. Hopefully we'll see an updated model. Yeah, compose that email for me. I've composed the email for you and opened up the mail app with a pre-filled email. You can review it, make any changes you like, and send it when you're ready. Yes, guys, that's what we want Siri to be uh, very soon. We know right now Siri is not there yet. It's just a matter of time. But in the meantime, I found something amazing that works really well. It's almost something that we hope Siri will be. And there are some awesome use cases for this. I've also added this new tool to my action button immediately. So I have quick access to it. And the possibilities are massive. Like you can do so much with this new voice assistant. And I'd like to show how I got it on my action button and what this new voice assistant can potentially do on your iPhone too. Okay, so the new app I'm talking about is Perplexity. Maybe you've heard of it, but yeah, it's extremely powerful and it just got a massive voice conversation update. To start, you need to go to the App Store, obviously, and make sure to download Perplexity. It's free. So we go to Perplexity and this is the app that you need. And now they introduced the iOS voice assistant. And the things it can do is absolutely mind blowing inside of iOS. From my understanding, this is one of the more sophisticated voice apps that can collaborate well with iOS. Make sure to download it. You can try it out for free. It's extremely powerful. And what I've done is I've assigned perplexity to my action button. And to do this, it's actually really simple. You need to go to your settings and in settings, you need to go to the action button and in here, I go to shortcut and then search for perplexity. You'll get the suggestions and it is the start of voice mode that you need. So press on that and then you should be good to go. And uh, when you press your action button, it will immediately open up the voice conversation mode of perplexity. One of the things we can do is I am going to a trip to Paris very soon and I'd like you to show uh, some awesome cafes and dinner spots in the sixth arrondissement. The sixth arrondissement in Paris is a great spot for cafes and dinner. For cafes, you can check out Le Dumagats and Café de Flore, which are famous and offer a classic Parisian experience. Café Madame and St. Pearl are also popular spots for a cozy atmosphere and delicious treats. For dinner, consider places like Le Bon Saint-Pourçain or Oxpreys, which have great reviews for their French cuisine. Enjoy your trip. Can you make a reservation in at Cafe Madame for four people at seven in the evening. I've directed you to the open table booking page to make a reservation at Cafe Madame for four people at seven in the evening. Check how crazy this is, what's possible with perplexity, how it recognizes the previous request that you made. Yeah, you can immediately order your table. And also, as I showed in the intro, you can send emails straight from Perplexity Voice. Uh, so let's do that. Uh, perplexity, send an email to tim at apple.com with subject excited for WWDC this year. Um, start with, hi Tim, really looking forward to speaking to you at WWDC this year. Um, extremely uh, looking forward to iOS, 8, iOS 19, iPadOS 19, watchOS 12, but also new updates to Apple Vision Pro. Um, thanks for replying and hopefully see you there. Niels. I've prepared the email for you. You can review and send it in the mail app. And there you have it. How awesome is that? I mean, this is how Siri should be. Some other things we can do with perplexity is for example, order an Uber. Order an Uber to Brussels airport right now. I've opened the Uber app for you with a ride to Brussels airport. You can complete the booking there. And as you can see, it's able to order an Uber straight on my iPhone. Really exciting stuff. And hopefully we can see this in Siri very soon natively. Another thing we can do is set specific reminders. So let's try that out right now. Set a reminder 30 minutes before the start of WWC 2025, please. Obviously you need to give access 
And as you can see, the reminder is set. I mean, how crazy is that? And lastly, what you, for example, can also do is immediately open your favorite podcast. So open um, the diary of a CEO podcast on Apple Podcasts, the latest episode, please. I've opened the diary of a CEO podcast in Apple Podcasts for you. Would you like to continue with anything else or terminate the session now? And there you have it, guys. I mean, these are just some snippets of what's possible with Perplexity right now. And I really, really hope that rather sooner than later, Apple is going to integrate similar features. We've had some awesome demos of the capabilities of Siri in iOS 18, and hopefully these will come to iOS 19. And I think Perplexity is really already showing what's possible here. So yeah, I hope this was helpful. And if you have any questions, please drop them down below in the comments. Thanks for being here and see you in the next one. Peace.